My friends, I want to share with you something. I am so excited that I just got this book. The Book of the Worlds by our beloved friend and teacher Rob Jor. And it says, Revealing a behind the curtains view of the ancient wisdom and highest secrets of creation. I want to tell you a little bit about this book and what he what the Rob is setting out to do. It's really fantastic. He's taking like these deep, mystical, old concepts and bring them down to earth to where we can begin to understand and grasp uh, some of this stuff in our uh, current um, realm and our current way of thinking. And uh, he does a fantastic job. He talks about why the world was made and how it's made and who you are and who I am. Uh, what's the world going to look like when the Messiah is here and um, how to help people understand who the Creator is. Really, really something extraordinary. I want to read you just a short little snippet when he talks about the Creator and us kind of coming to know um, who the Creator is. And he says, I, I used to have a, an example I've used many times to try and explain to an individual the existence of the Creator. It's like trying to explain the existence of water to a fish. You see how like clever he is to get this down-to-earth stuff? It doesn't matter if the fish is in a tank or in the ocean. He's in the water, but he doesn't see and experience the water as we do. He sees food, he's able to breathe, he sees other fish and so many other things. He has his own plans for every day. However, if you try to explain the concept of water, he would never understand it. Right now he's concerned about eating because he's hungry. He's unaware that his very existence is dependent on the water. It's only if you remove him for a moment from the water, then he arrives at the shocking realization of the existence of the water. Pretty fantastic explanation. So, how are we different than the fish, he says. We can say things like, everything is the creator. But in truth, right now we might not have time to think about the creator. Isn't that true for so many of us, and he's often saying, don't forget the Creator, don't forget the Creator. <laughs> we might be hungry, thirsty, or tired. We should only realize that it is impossible to eat or to drink without the Creator. It is He who supplies all our needs. Also, we are incapable of sleeping or waking because it is He who allows us to fall asleep and then awakens us again in the morning. Really, really amazing down-to-earth teachings from Rob Jor. I would absolutely love to recommend that you guys pick up this book. Um, it's available from emuna.com, E-M-U-N-A-H.com by our beloved friend, Dror Moshe Kasuto. I think you will be very, very happy that you picked up this book.